Anypoint Platform Gateway, Flex Gateway, how CORS works, the uh, the XML HTTP request X uh, HR in a JavaScript, JavaScript flow for de uh, determining whether to execute the actual request. Uh, here you can see the uh, uh, XML HTTP request uh, XHR in uh, JavaScript flow for determining whether to execute the actual request. Uh, in uh, how course work in Flex Gateway in any point platform gateway. When your web pages request data, the browser detects the whether detects whether the request is from uh, within the same origin or determines whether to apply the course algorithm. If you are query from a web page that is not in your origin, uh, uh, then the course policy is applied. The course algorithm works on the web server and uh, on the client side for the web page that requested the information. The client side algorithm in the course policy is implemented by determining whether uh, the request is complex or and potentially dangerous and sending preliminary pre-flight pre request to verify whether the server accept the origin. Uh, uh, and uh, executing actual request and validating the server response correctly and accepting accept the origin. Pre-flight is a primary request uh, using options and as HTTP uh, header. As, as the HTTP method from the web browser uh, to the backend server to test the ident identity, origin and a few other headers on of the web page that is trying to perform the request. If the backend does not accept the origin, the backend server responds to the request without a specifying header, access control or allow origin. Uh, the uh, client then understand the page origin is not allowed. Uh, Uh, allow that in the server and uh, does not execute the actual request. The following diagram shows the XML HTTP request uh, request uh, XHR in a JavaScript uh, in a JavaScript flow de for determining whether to execute the actual request. As illustrated in the diagram, the request is validated based on the communication between the uh, uh, browser and the server. Uh, if the request is considered to be complex. Uh, then the uh, pre-flight uh, uh, request is executed. If the server does not ret uh, return the proper course response, uh, Uh, proper, proper course response headers uh, for the pre-flight then the, uh, the client, client library uh, XHR uh, is not allowed to perform actual request. Uh, if the pre-flight response is correct and complete, then the uh, client library execute the actual request, which include uh, certain course headers. Um, uh, the client library then validates the course headers of the response. If some of the required headers are missing, uh, uh, 
then the uh, client library is oblique to block the response from the reach in the client which is usually a web page Here you can see uh, the uh, path of the uh, latency and this is part of uh, added latency. Here the uh, JavaScript makes a cross domain Excel uh, uh, HR call uh, and it's connected to uh, is, is it a get or head. If it is yes, it is connected to uh, are there any custom HTTP headers. If it is no, it is connected to uh, is it a post. If it is yes, it's connected to is this content is types standard. If it is yes, it's connected to are there custom HTTP uh, headers. If it is yes, it's connected to uh, make options to call to server with all custom details. And if it is, uh, uh, is it a post? If no, it's connected to make options call to server with custom details. Uh, and if, if, if the content type standard and if it is no, make options call to server with all custom details and uh, uh, make options uh, call uh, call to server with all custom details is connected to did server response with appropriate cross control headers if it is uh, yes it is connected to make actual xhr and if it is no it is connected to errors and uh, here the other are there uh, custom HTTP headers? If it is no, it's connected to make actual X, uh, XHR. And here the uh, is get, is it a get he or head? And is it a post? And is it is the content type standard? And are there in custom HTTP headers? And make actual XLR uh, are in path of standard latency and make options call to server with all custom headers and did server response with appropriate access control headers. Uh, uh, are in a path of added latency. Now, uh, this is the uh, end of my presentation. Thank you very much for watching it.